This touchdown pass from Mike Ford to Randall White staked the Skeeters to a 7 to nothing halftime lead over Wichita Falls Rider last Saturday night. Mesquite went on to register a 14 to nothing upset of the state's top ranked team. But after looking at game films this week, Coach Tom Gray preferred to rave about the way his defense performed in the second half of that game. Well, it's, it's a comfort feeling going into half, seven to nothing. And, and of course, I felt like the turning point of the ball game was uh, in the second half when they came back and they had two long drives and our kids just bowed their neck and uh, we didn't let them get inside our 20. And uh, I think that's a turning point in the ball game. You had tremendous pursuit on defense. Boy, our kids did. Uh, our kids really came to play and uh, we had great pursuit, and uh, a team like Ryder that has such great speed, you've got to have great pursuits. You really have. So we have great fans, and uh, they really let the kids know they're there. And I know the other night when the defense had come off, you know, they'd stand up, and they really let the kids know they were there. And when the offense came off, they let them know. And believe me, the kids really appreciate that. Across the street, Hanby Stadium is empty as the Skeeters work out in preparation for the Paladuro game. One thing you can be sure of, though, there won't be any empty seats in the stadium Saturday night as the Skeeters try to turn the home field advantage into a state semifinal playoff spot. Ray Gaskin, Channel 8 News, Mesquite.